Alright everybody, welcome back to another video of Fortnite Battle Royale. And today, we are going to be giving you another 5 tips of how to let you win a game of Fortnite. Okay, so let's move into the first tip. It's landing. As you can see in this footage here, I land in Salty Springs. And as you can tell, I get one of the luckiest landings ever and get the best loot in a matter of around, you know, um, less than two minutes. So, I would love for you guys to drop in Salty Springs all the time. And, you know, it, it gives you great loot. You know, that's all I can really say. It just gives you epic loot that will let you win basically every time. Quick, easy loot. Only a couple people land there. Um... Uh, so yeah, just land at Salty Springs or um, other places, you know, just always keep on landing in places to get you, you know, slowly you like this place more than this place. You know, you gotta learn for yourself. To me, Salty Springs is the best place to land. It just gives you so, so good loot. So yeah, let's move on to tip number two. Okay, so now I know that this tip sounds kind of like a stupid one, don't die. That does sound really stupid, but it really isn't. By don't die, I mean don't always charge up. When you see someone, don't strive for kills. I see many players walking into the storm to get a kill and end up dying because people shoot them and they get too weak and then the storm finish them off. Even if you get the kill and, you know, you take people out, sometimes you don't always win. If you get less aggressive, you will win a bit more. Now, don't I don't mean like just hide in, four, in, in little bunkers in a one-by-one one base and, you know, that that's just lame to do. You don't want to do that. I'm just saying don't be stupid by just attacking whenever you want, you know what I mean? Don't just, like, attack, just attack, attack. You see this one, you just place a launch pad and just go. You place a launch pad whenever you need to get somewhere. Not, I mean, you gotta always have a launch pad in your inventory. To uh, a little bit of a bonus tip here for me, um, uh, always keep have a launch pad ready. So don't just waste launch pad to get into the ring. Have a launch pad for whenever, like you know, you're in the middle of a battle. Because th th those things are really good. If you're in the middle of a battle, you're about to lose. Again, don't be so aggressive and just try to win. Just keep bu building and make a make it a build battle. No, all you need to do launch pad away. Be be ready for when you need to give up and in a battle. You have you have an AR. That guy has a pump shotgun. You're not gonna win. So uh, yeah. Now let's move on to tip number three. Okay. So moving on to the next tip. This tip is a little bit more detailed. So I had this in my first part of this, but this is a more detailed version and a more useful version. Carry three weapons and two healables now if you don't like that loadout you can always come up with your own but let me tell you something if this is basically a tip for only console players but if you keep um you know your rifle i keep it on the last um i keep my rifle usually on the very left on the very left and i keep my shotgun on the very um on the on the left and then right after that to so the second slot and then I keep like my sniper or or whatever my extra right weapon is on the very back so you have to keep your your loadout whatever kind you want you can keep your own but you have to always keep it like that so whenever you're in the middle battle you remember the way your loadout is so that's something you really need to do and like especially with the new items you know it gets really confusing whenever you know jetpacks come in and stuff like that but it's okay you know you kind of keep it like you keep it the way you know your range weapons all the way at the back your rifle is all at the front then your shotgun is the, the the second slot you know you keep it like that and it's easier when you're in the middle of battle you know the buttons to click to get to the right item so without further ado let's get into tip number four so tip number four is try new things now i know this thinks this seems to be like a thing like oh yeah try new things to have more fun with the game no this is to get better like just to take example the the hand cannon it's seen as a crap weapon but you can get a bunch of kills camping with that thing it is deadly and if you double hand cannon it's destroyed always try new tactics and stuff you'll find some stuff pretty useful let me give you a solid one some of you guys may not know double heavy heavy uh pump is obviously super easy the double pump everybody knows about that but heavy shotgun shoots pretty quickly the double heavy shotgun is even quicker you would think that it's not but it really is and it's worth the double space it just instantly kills two shots and the, the, the opponent's gone if you get both in the head they're like destroyed even if they have 100 100 so always try new things and also um as trying new things try new edits um new edits are also very good with 
um, yeah, so new edits are very good because you can always, like, there's certain edits that people don't know, you know, there's the window edit, there's the, the all different kinds of edits, so, yeah, and now let's go into the final but most important tip. Right, so the final and most, um, obvious one is, um, a Builder Pro, so I always use Builder Pro, it is a new, um, control set, it is the best control set, it is the fastest to build, it is as fast as building with, um, PC, if not even faster, just kidding, but it, it, you could pause the video right here if you want. For a if you play on PlayStation, pause the video right here. Builder Pro, just so much quicker. Uh, look at the top controls uh, for for building. It is so much faster than his for Xbox One. It is way faster and way better. So, anyways, um, yeah, that was my top five um ever top five, you know, tips to win the game. So yeah, if you enjoyed, don't forget to leave that like button. And if you enjoyed, also comment down below for more Fortnite videos on what kind of Fortnite videos you would you guys would like. So yeah, thanks for watching. Bye bye. See you guys later.